Hello and welcome to Rajshri Food. My name is Anuradha Toshniwal and today I'm going to show you what the hot season brings for us, a lovely pudding with mangoes. Very simple to make, very fast with all the ingredients that are available at home. Let me show you the ingredients. One tin of condensed milk, 200 ml. The same tin quantity of yogurt, the same tin quantity of milk. Two chopped mangoes. We have with us a ring mold which has been greased. We need a steaming vessel which has water in it and we shall be steaming it in this. If you have a dhokla or idli maker, you can steam your pudding in that. So let's get started. So I'm going to take my tin of condensed milk and pour it into a bowl. Make sure you take every bit of it. I'm going to pour the milk into this tin. Same quantity of milk. Mix it with the condensed milk, yogurt. Measure it in the tin. So if you're buying commercial yogurt, you'll need about 250 grams. And adding it again to our condensed milk mixture. Now all we have to do is whisk it well to amalgamate and get well mixed. It doesn't have to be beaten hard. Just that the condensed milk, the yogurt breaks up and the milk gets in well immersed with each other. So that's given, given us a smooth mixture. All the yogurt particles are gone. Now I'll pour it into our ring mold. So our steaming vessel is ready. I'm going to place our ring mold into the vessel. Gently cover it with our lid and let it steam. So our pudding is boiling. And I'm going to take it off the gas. You will insert a knife into the pudding and if it comes out clean, it's done. Gently take it out of the water. And we have to let it cool completely. So while our pudding is cooling down, we shall make the sauce uh, with, with the mangoes. I have here two chopped mangoes. I'm going to add about half of this and churn them up into a paste. Now in this season we are making it with mangoes but when it is strawberry season you can make it with strawberries with the strawberry sauce. When it is fresh fig season you can make it with fresh figs with the fig sauce in red wine if you like or you can make it with an orange sauce and fresh oranges. So you can make this pudding all the year round so don't let the mangoes deter you into not making it all the year round. So now our pudding is cold. What I'm going to do is I'm going to scrape a knife through the edge. Remove the excess water that's going to come out. Take my dish and keep it over the ring mold and gently invert it. We'll take some of our sauce. Pile our mangoes in the center, some at the corners if you like, and a steamed mango pudding is ready to be served. Do not forget to keep it very very chilled and you can make this a day before, you can make it in the morning. Only remember to remove the excess water and to keep it cool. I hope you enjoyed that and I hope to see you soon signing off now but before that don't forget to subscribe to Rajshri Food and do write to us about any queries or any wishes that you may have. Thank you very much and bye bye.